This is the Mid-Atlantic Ridge, the world's longest mountain range you've never heard of because it's underwater. The ridge cuts the Atlantic Ocean in half, separating different tectonic plates. Where these plates meet, volcanic eruptions bring to the surface all sorts of precious metals, including gold and silver, but also important elements like rare earths. At the beginning of 2024, the Norwegian parliament voted to authorize seabed exploration for mining in areas of the Norwegian Sea between Norway and Greenland. This decision has opened a Pandora's box that could result in enormous consequences for the environment and geopolitics. And they plan to do it here far off the coast of Norway. If Norway can pull this project off, they expect to find more than 38 million tons of copper and 45 million tons of zinc, as well as cobalt, scandium, magnesium, vanadium, titanium and manganese, at depths of around 3000 meters below sea level. However, the measure has been strongly contested by many researchers and activists concerned about the potential environmental risks extended seabed mining may pose. Even Equinor, Norway's leading oil company, has expressed concerns about the threat seabed mining poses to the ocean and marine biodiversity. On the same note, several multinational companies worldwide, including BMW, Google, Volvo and Samsung have all signed the World Wildlife Fund's past calls for a moratorium on seabed mining. 